YouTube, what's going on? It is Amy again with Bargain Mama, and today I have a very small Goodwill haul for you, but I need to get it done so that I can, one of the things I specifically went into Goodwill for is for one of my patients for this week. Sorry, I was trying to figure out, my air does not feel like it's getting cold enough and it's hot. It's 88 degrees here where I live, so hot. So I think I fixed it, but anyways, one of my patients really wants to make a, um, like a mod bot or something. Um, it's like where the, the things fight and usually they're electrical, but obviously we're not going that extreme. So it's like a car that you build and it fights with other cars, but my boys are older and we don't have things like that. And I am not going to be able to build like a, an actual car and then put the stuff on it so I decided to go to Goodwill to see if they had any kind of a car that we could kind of put like a shoe box or something over and decorate and put little fighting stuff in so that's what I did I found this and so these do not move the little wheels under here move which I thought would be really cool so we could kind of rest something up on this area and then this would be kind of really cool looking and then this goes up and down it is <laughs> let me just tell you i would not buy this on a normal day like i was on a hunt for something i don't know maybe i can fix it a little before i get there but i don't know i'll try to figure it out but i figured like we could definitely like this could be the front of our thing to fight i don't know so this was $3.99, but because today orange is half off, I paid $2 for this, so it was worth it. We'll fix it up and make it into like a fighting, I don't know, robot thing. So, and then I had brought the other stuff. Sorry guys, I'm reaching. So I had bought the other, brought the other stuff from my house, but I just could not find anywhere. And I didn't want to pay like $20 for a new kind of Tonka truck that we were just going to cover up and do that so that's what I got that for long explanation so again my middle son lives in LA so we are doing his Easter tonight and so I'll show you guys maybe what I put in his Easter basket I used I had gotten a while ago one of the Star Wars bags from Dollar Tree so that's what I'm using for him because he lives in a dorm room and he does not have a whole lot of room so an Easter basket is kind of like uh, a I don't want to say a waste of money but it's gonna just go in the trash whereas in California they use reusable bags so he can reuse the bag after and carry all of his stuff home in his car when he goes home so I have a lot of stuff for him so far I he's kind of easy to shop for he likes anything Marvel he loves Star Wars stuff like that so a Dollar Tree and a lot of places I've just been having a lot of that lately so his Easter basket was is pretty full but then I found this you guys so I found this cup it's $2.99 so on this side it says what a menace like with a menace like that in the city every second counts you see it was $2.99 and it has the Captain America on this side it has the thing down there I don't know where it's from but it is like like let me just show you the inside so like the cup part is right there but I don't know how to explain it like you see that it's like they don't meet with each other which I think is cool so I did get this for him I thought it was really cool and again this was $2.99 and I saw this I know he's gonna be like mom what do I need so many cups for it but they're so cool I just can't tell myself no I will throw this away just so you guys know so this right here is the Star Wars cup if you guys see it, it as Yoda CP3O Luke there's Vader it just says Star Wars there's um, Boba I mean just everything this says rebel um, so and this was $2.99 but because it was orange it was only a dollar fifty and so yeah it's just like a regular tumbler cup it says BPA free, made in China, hand wash, you know. So again, I'll throw the straw away, but I thought this was really cute for $1.50. So I got that. Then I did pick oopsie, this Hallmark newsletter set up for $1.99. And I don't know what it looks like. It says a unique and memorable way to send your newsletters and photos. 18 newsletters, enough sheets, cards, and envelopes to make. So in the store, I was like, I think I bought it. 
more because I want to know what's in it. So let's just see, guys. Okay. Oh my gosh. So just so you guys know, I already have these cards at home. I, I feel like they are like moving away cards. Maybe not. Um, so they're just Christmas cards. So that, that kind of sucks because I have so many Christmas cards at home. But I guess it's not too bad because it looks like then you have a pocket right here. It's not too bad. I just noticed that. So there's a pocket already made right here. And there's a pocket already made right here. So there's a pocket on this side and a and a pocket on this side and they all buy, are by Hallmark and so that's actually kind of cool because I can just like put something over them but then what is this and this just paper I think yeah so then this is just oh wait what is it these are more of the same thing so and then yes these this is just paper so this is just paper to do whatever you want with so and that's the back side of it so you don't even have to use the front so i, mean, I guess that's kind of cute like i bought it more for i do like the pockets no it's not gonna want to go back in i like the pockets in those so very cute again this is by hallmark it says it's a newsletter set and it is $1.99 and it says you write print assemble and send so that's kind of cool keep it moving you know what I need to see my receipt because I saw these books sitting there and I didn't know how much they were but I was like so I think they were $1.99 each okay these were just sitting in a random aisle I would have never seen them but so let me just first explain I just I'm almost done with my son's um hold on one second guys okay sorry about that so I'm almost done with my son's um kind of memory card that not memory card like memory book that I wanted to make him but unfortunately I used like a huge book and so now I'm having like cut paper and all this stuff to make it all fit on there so when I saw these I thought these were the perfect size so they are a bigger size book I don't know what's um I don't I don't even know how big they are but they're bigger and so this is Chinese painting one by the chows I don't know but look at these pages so these will not go in his obviously, but I, like I said, I just realized like, I don't have like the bigger paper. I have just like standard sized paper. So I picked these up for the next book I do. So there's that one. And again, it was $1.99. And then I found this one in the same spot. This is published by Walter T. Foss, Colors, tr Trees in Shrubs, Weeds, I don't know. So here's the front of the book, but I mean, look at these beautiful pictures inside the book to do on paper. And the paper is already like a different color. So you could literally just glue it on, rip it and glue it on. So, and again, I liked that they were bigger because I realized I don't have any bigger. So this is again, one of the bigger ones. So I got that. I really like that. Those were $1.99 each. This is my last thing that I got there. It's by the Paper Studio. It says 2011 Paper Studio, 12 by 12, the basics, 180 pack. And it's probably not completely full, but it's full. I mean, it's like full, full, guys. Like, first of all, let me just, since I'm going through it, let me just show you kind of the, the, color, the paper. I love that one, the yellow. But it's a lot of paper, a lot. So this was $3.99. And so it's just called The Basics. And the price on this says $19.99. But again, it's from 2011 but and these are all the designs in the front but there is a lot still in there so guys that is my goodwill haul um and yeah i hope everyone is having a great day like i said i had to get this one done so that i could get my little tonka truck thing over to my patient's house so we can make our um it's like it's called a bot blocks i think bot blocks um so we made our list last week of what we needed for me to bring this week so i brought it and I will show you a picture if it comes out. I have no idea how we're going to do this. I've never even done this with my boys. Uh, so we'll see what happens, but I hope you guys have a great day. Bye guys.